All right, it's phase three of the device. I've got it all wired up. Clearly I need some wire management. And I've got the second monitor structure. And like before, the camera sees through the teleprompter glass. That's 50-50 glass. That means half of what it sees is through the glass to that monitor, and half of what it sees is the reflection in the glass of that monitor. And that makes a feedback loop and a fractal because of that reflected image. And the same thing is happening over here with this camera. And that's the new thing to this device. And the way I have the monitors positioned, this is uh, like a plant-like thing over here, and this is a jellyfish-like thing. So you got your viewing monitors to see what you're doing, your control knobs, hue, brightness, saturation, contrast for all four monitors, and you move the cameras here, rotating and forwards and backwards. So you got your plant-like thing and your jellyfish-like thing. So nothing really new going on here, except there's two of them at once, but this is where things get interesting. You got the little corpus callosum here, so both sides can talk to each other. So if I change the input on this switcher, this takes the jellyfish from that side and puts it on the lower monitor here, influencing the plant-like thing and making a plant-like thing made of jellyfish-like things. So here's your jellyfish. Here's your plant made of jellyfish. I'm gonna move that back. And if I change the input on this switcher, this takes the plant-like thing and uh, puts it on the top monitor in this case, because of the way the monitor inputs are. And it creates a jellyfish-like thing made of the plant-like thing. So this is still not completely new because in the last uh, iteration, I had one fractal being made from another fractal. But this is where things get kind of interesting because if I change this over here to input two, now the plant-like thing made of the jellyfish-like thing is over here and the jellyfish-like thing made of the plant-like thing is over here and then that goes over there and that goes over here and that goes over here and that goes over there. And there's a feedback loop like this that is going at the same time these are going. And this gets really complicated and it takes some very delicate controlling of the knobs here because it tends to make a big mess. But if you do it just right, some magic will happen. Oh.